So Felis Leo. Felis is the genus, Leo is the species. Sir, for example, if you know the name of the taxonomist, if you know the name of the taxonomist, you can write the name of the scientist after the scientific name. Okay. For example, Felis Leo scientific name was proposed by whom? Linnaeus proposed the Felis Leo scientific name to the lion actually. For example, Felis Leo, if you know the scientific name, you can write the name of the scientist after the species word. So Linnaeus or Felis Leo Lin or Felis Leo L means after the scientific name the taxonomist name can be written either in the full form or in the abbreviated form you can write full name of the scientist after the scientific name otherwise you can write abbreviated form or short form of the scientist sir here if you know the year of discovery okay in which year that scientific name was proposed so you can write the year of discovery or year of proposal after the name of the scientist after the name of the scientist for example so this was proposed in 1758 okay means the 1758 is the year Linnaeus is the name of the taxonomist and this is scientific name and one more thing if genus is changed furtherly if the genus is changed furtherly after the changed genus and species name the original scientist name who proposed the actual oldest word so that scientific name scientist name as well as year of discovery can be written in the brackets for example if you take actually Felis has turned into Panthera Panthera Leo. So this is the new scientific name of the lion. Panthera Leo is a changed genus name. Actually, Felis was the original genus name. But this Felis is changed into Panthera. So Panthera Leo and you can write the name of the scientist as well as year of the discovery in the brackets. So now you can write Linnaeus 1758 so these are the steps we have to follow when we are doing binomial nomenclature this is very important four marks question so describe the process of binomial nomenclature in the binomial nomenclature it was proposed uh, popularized by Carolus Linnaeus in the 10th edition of his system and natural book and uh, as per binomial two words are present in the scientific name first name is genus second name is species species is uh, genus is a noun species is an adjective genus starts with capital letter species starts with small letter okay here we can see leo leo l small letter and uh, scientific name must be latin language and when you are printing it must be printed in italic type whenever you are typing in the system we have to type in italic type and we have to underline them separately and we can write the name of the taxonomist after the scientific name you can write the year of discovery after the scientist name and if the genus name is changed original genus proposed scientist name can be written in the brackets or parentheses so this is about the binomial nomenclature